Assalamu alaikum. Today we are going to demonstrate how batteries exist naturally that work on similar principles as man-made batteries. Our hypothesis is that lemons make stronger batteries than potatoes. We research different fruits and vegetables that act as nature's batteries. Lemons and potatoes both have citric and other acids in them that are similar to the chemical acids inside a battery. The more sour a fruit or vegetable is, the higher the level of acid inside. Vegetables or fruits with more acid make stronger batteries. Potatoes are electrochemical cells that convert chemical energy into electrical energy. The materials are the multimeter, the clock, the potatoes, the copper strips, the zinc strips, and the insulated wires, and the lemons. So when we attach the copper strips to the potatoes and the zinc strips, and we attach the insulated wires to them, and we did the same thing to the potatoes, and we attached the clock to it too. And then we, now we're going to measure the potatoes multimeter, which is 0.7. And then we'll do the same with the lemons. Okay, when we connected the uh, volts to lemons, it's showing 1.3 to 1.4 volts. We can conclude from this experiment that lemons make stronger batteries as compared to potatoes. The practical application for our experiment is that if you don't have an outlet to charge your phone when you are outside, all you need is a potato or a lemon to actually charge your phone. Let's show you how. Each of these fruits and vegetables could potentially have 1.5 volts of electricity. If we connected all of these fruits and vegetables, we can potentially have 6 volts of electricity, which is enough to charge these phones which only needs 5 volts of electricity. This USB connector has two electrodes. One is positive and, and another is negative. If they were zinc and copper, respectively, and if you uh, put it inside, uh, inside this lemon, it could potentially charge this phone.